what really amazed me about my class is that I've been doing healthcare related things uh, for pretty much my entire adult life and so I felt like I really had a good uh, understanding and basic background in hospital versus physician versus uh, you know cancer research and different kinds of aspects of, of healthcare but spending as much time as we did with uh, 20 other people all related to the healthcare business really gave me such a broader perspective uh, than my, my own per, uh, perspective and uh, really not only got to make some really great lifelong friends uh, out of it but also have a, just a really different uh, uh, perspective which I, I think is clearly the best part of the ALF program is expanding uh, our, our perspective on issues. Well, very early on in the ALF process, we talked about uh, convening groups and having conversations and what it meant to be uh, a good citizen. And I had really never thought in exactly those terms, but had always felt like there needed to be more collaborative efforts and more people needed to, uh, uh, to visit about things. And so uh, what ALF did for me was at least put a framework around some kind of internal feelings that I had on, on certain things that uh, uh, allowed me to have a framework that I could talk to literally hundreds of other people that have also kind of been through that uh, uh, same, same framework. And so. Well, I think I've always been a very collaborative leader. I love to work in teams. I don't like to do anything by myself. Well, my wife also knows that I don't like to be by myself. And so uh, I enjoy having a group of people around me that we can say what are we going to do together uh, as as a team and um, I think that's really been very helpful to me because uh, it works very well in the, from the ALF standpoint as well because it's about how do you collaborate how do you uh, expand knowledge and I've always believed uh, not just that two heads are better than one but generally six heads are better mm -hmm. than uh, <laughs> than two so it's uh, it sometimes be, is a little bit slower, but I like working in teams. I am I'm working on the biggest professional challenge of my entire career, which is actually pretty exciting. I happen to be talking to you right now. Uh, in that, uh, our organization is in the midst of what's going on in the transformation of healthcare in the United States. We are uh, a safety net health plan we would be greatly uh, impacted by the implementation of the Affordable Care Act in Texas, both the health insurance exchanges that are part of that and the Medicaid expansion. Uh, and so I am never been a, a big political person, but I am actively uh, advocating for how Texas could implement uh, the Affordable Care Act in a way that is both politically possible in Texas, but ends up covering millions of, of new Texans. I just, I see the uninsured people mm -hmm. and we have six million of them in Texas and that's way too many and we have a tremendous opportunity to reduce uh, the number of uninsured people in Texas that it's just easier to not do it and I'm determined to be part of a, a group of people that might actually make it happen.